22 ounces. Okay guys, nutritional yeast, this is Cal Brand. Fortified, premium, unsweetened, gluten-free. It does really have a nut, wonderful nutty flavor. Vegan friendly, and yes, if you're a vegan, you probably have to be taking this because it's got a lot of good B vitamins in here, especially the B12. Maybe you've heard that before. Anyways, this goes great on pizza, pastas, whatever you're gonna do uh, that's your vegan style. But it's it, it really is a great cheese alternative. I've seen keto recipes where people use this in cauliflower to make mac and cheese. So a lot of other aminos in there. Other B vitamins. Choline considered basically a B vitamin and ositol as well. Lithium can help you feel good. Primary grown yeast. Folic acid B12. So this is definitely probably going to be the best value because of the size. But most of the time I would usually suggest Bragg's nutritional yeast. Just because Bragg's has a really good... They'll send you an analysis certificate anytime you request it from their website. And I don't know otherwise... I mean, it looks like they really try and keep all the sourcing in here great. But anyways, if you guys would like to help support the channel, if you've never had nutritional yeast, if you are vegan or mostly vegetarian, you most likely would benefit due to the B vitamin content in this. Personally, I would go through this pretty fast if I was using this right now. Um, you might want to watch out, though, because it's still a yeast. And if you have way too much yeast overgrowth in your body, it could cause a problem, in which case you may benefit from coconut oil in your diet as well. Possibly three to four tablespoons slowly work up. But another thing that I've known is really good at helping eliminate yeast in your body that I've done is turpentine cleanses. But maybe that's too extreme for you. Do your own research, guys. <laughs> 